first finish! There we go! Hello everyone, I am Tankai. I am waiting for my rare Achilles, and they're not. Hello there, Mimako. I have your new rare Achilles right here. What about the latest random booster with their night? I am sorry, but this is Canada Post. That's all for today. Me. Paco. What are you doing? So today, for our Beyblade show, we're going to be taking a look at... Are you taking a look at Air Knight? No, I don't have Air Knight. Then when will you get it? When am I going to get it? I don't know. Maybe tomorrow. Leave me alone. <laughs> so today for our Beyblade show, we're going to be taking a look at Chosey Achilles. But you might be asking, we already did take a look at Chosey Achilles. We did a whole video on it. However, thanks to a very special person who's able to sell us it. There's a link in the description below for that. For the eBay store we're able to purchase this from, we have Black Josie, Black Josie Achilles. So, the rates to get Josie Achilles, the black version, is one in every twenty. I'm pretty sure. So, with uh, Spriggan Requiem, the black version of Black Revive Phoenix, it was one in every seventy-two. So, it's a little bit easier to get a Black Josie Achilles. However, it is a little bit more based on luck. Unlike with Spriggan, they took out any of that little engraving trick that uh, we used before. So for Black Revive Phoenix, that was a lot of luck. Same thing here with Josie Achilles. So we're gonna be taking a look at it. So the only real difference between that and the original is just the layer. However, the layer looks super cool. So let's just take a look. Ta-da! Oh, it looks so cool. I do kind of wish for the other variant of the bay it wasn't just the layer, as maybe like the performance tip at least too. Maybe change just a little bit, because, you know, same color for everything. But I mean, overall, it's not that bad. So let's take a look. Now we have another LR launcher, which this launcher is really good. It has a super long rip cord. We did give the measurements in our original unboxing of Chosey Achilles. Decent launcher, not decent launcher, pretty good launcher. You can switch from left and right, it's in the theme of Achilles. Here we have the actual black Chosey Achilles. Oh, that is so cool. Stickers for it. It comes with a little paper to congratulate you on the fact that you got it. Look at this lair, amazing. Here's this little paper congratulating you that you got a black version of Chisetsu Achilles. Or the dark version of it, I guess. Really cool. Some of the other parts, there's not really any major differences other than the layer, but uh, let's take a look at it. Here we have the black Chozy Achilles, and man, does it look sick. I'll probably just call it Dark Chozy Achilles, even if it is just called like the black version of it. It looks really really sick it is pretty minor but you can see the shield and the sword on the side are red instead of blue and the red part there is black that's kind of it for differences really i didn't really know what to expect so with the original spring and requiem you can see these are the colors and after for the black version you get black gold and you get red in the middle i did think maybe the core in the middle would be painted red i i guess not so with the uh, Phoenix and Black Revive Phoenix, you can see a few subtle differences. So this is about as tight as uh, the one, the regular Achilles that I have. It's uh, dead Hades teeth. So back and everything, it does look super, super awesome. So overall, this is like a for for like an evil recolor. Not, well, not really evil for a black, dark version recolor. It's like a. Solid 8. I like it. I'll be testing uh, this bay out. Again, there's not really any, there's not really too many differences. Quickly go over something else. So, to mend my confusion before in the original review of Chizetsu Achilles, this is the Dimension Driver. So, technically, there's uh, six different models altogether, but there's main three different heights. So, there's this part right here that you gotta match. This part right here, little square thing. 
So you'll see the little tab bubble. When you move it, the little tab or the needle goes in. And as you move to each height, when you match it, the needle comes out. When you move it, it goes back to attack. So there's balance mode and attack mode. So then after this is like the second last height you can put it in, you see the needle's out, and then for the tallest height it becomes an attack type. So it is a pretty crazy balance type Beyblade. I mean overall, I like it. I still think maybe some things could have been different, but what are you going to do? So now we'll be moving on to the test launch portion of this video. So since this bay does have the Tozy Awakening system, We'll do one regular test launch, just showing off the bay, and then after I'll see if I can get the awakening on it. We'll use my LR Achilles uh, launcher. Two. Yeah, and it's attack mode. It's a little aggressive, a little aggressive. Second height balance mode. I'm gonna rip. That's what I'm expecting with this bay. It looks amazing when it's spinning around. So now what I'm gonna be doing is, oh! Oh yeah, well the needle's out so it can't really stop. We're gonna use the awakening system, see if we can uh, get everything out just to show it. I believe all the wings and everything is out. Yeah, there it is. So with all the wings and everything out with the full stoppers activated, this is how the bay looks. Pretty nice, pretty nice. We're gonna do some battles, I guess. I'll announce uh, what mode and what height I'm using for the Achilles. We'll do it against uh, Requiem and Phoenix. So we'll do our first round, which will be Chozetsu Achilles against Spriggan Requiem. Well, more specifically, it's Black Spriggan Requiem. And uh, Dimension is in its shortest height in balance mode. Spriggan's in defense. Right rotation. Yeah, the teeth on this aren't too good, but when it's like a full force, it just goes insane. Let's do this in left now. So shortest height, the same thing for Achilles, and we'll see. Oh! Oh! It beat Requiem and left in an attack. Let's do Spriggan in defense, I guess, and we'll do Achilles in its tallest attack mode. We're gonna Achilles attack! Let's do one final one in stamina left for Requiem. So we have Black Revive Phoenix, and we'll be doing Chozetsu Achilles. We'll do it in the shortest height possible, balance mode. Phoenix. I mean, the armor's out. Yeah, I'm still not really too much of a fan of Chizetsu Achilles. I still like the version of it. I think the full stoppers are out on that one. Shortest height in attack mode. Not making any hits. Nice, nice. Tallest type possible, which basically makes it into our attack mode. Shoot. They're doing the shoot. Ah, first finish. 
finish. There we go. Final battle between the two Achilles to determine which one is stronger. And also just for the fun of it. I guess at the end of the day, the black or the dark version of Josie Achilles is the strongest one. So my overall opinion on this Achilles, it is, it looks cool for the variant. I'm still not too much of a fan of the stock for this bay. Again, double O is a good reason to at least get it. Dimension is very eh, but uh, I'm excited to actually try out this bay a bit more. Uh, also, tell me in the comment section below, uh, what do you think is the best combo for Chizetsu Achilles? Um, and I'm also curious on what combos could work for Chizetsu Achilles with Extend Plus. I might do a sequel video where I'm actually going to be trying out uh, these combos. And because this bait is so awesome and pretty powerful, this video has to get a thousand likes. And if this video gets to a thousand likes, maybe you'll see something pretty special. But for now, have an awesome day. Subscribe and click that bell to be notified of my uploads.